The farmer is on duty. It was a breezy day and the door opened. His beloved cow got out. Listen, dear. Go back in. The cow refused and the farmer was irritated. He even tried to pet the cow and make her go back in but the cow stood reluctant. You need to go back in and let me do my work. The cow sarcastically agrees and punches him off. The cow is evil. The farmer now sneakily approached and poked its tail. What? The cow was somehow manipulated back to the barn. Oh no! The cows were happily grazing now at the meadows on a breezy day. But the farmer is here to trap that one crazy cow and ruin its moment of happiness. He literally built her a house within fraction of seconds. Well, if you are bad, then I'm your dad. So please don't mess with me. Welcome to the animal school. Congratulations to Gorilla for being the best student to top the class once again. You all need to learn from him. Fox is jealous. <laughs> Mr. Gorilla is giving me a hard time again. He is damaging my reputation. It's the chemistry class. And Mr. Bear is teaching them. All the student animals are hearing to him attentively. Hear you all. This chemical is a really dangerous component. If it leaks, then we are going to fall into a major trouble. That's why we preserved it safely. Remember not to touch this at any cost. You all are prohibited from touching this. The students obediently agreed. Attention everyone! I'm going to pour this chemical into a volcano. the miniature volcanic eruption for you all. Now you all can get back to work. I'm done completing my experiment, sir. The fox is burning in jealousy. I can't bear this anymore. I will be landing everyone in trouble now. Time to create some chaos. The foxy's sight fell upon the dangerous chemical. He quickly grabbed the chemical and poured it into the volcano. As expected, the trouble had landed. The what? volcano began erupting dangerously. The animals began running right away. The whole town got sunk under the lava. Animals were taking shelter at the monkey's place. Help me out! I'm burning! 
The gorilla soon came there with a raft and placed all the animals safely. I'll be taking them to nearby island. All right, I'll save the missing animals and get there soon. The gorilla began sailing and soon another raft came for the monkey. He was sailing and found the fox and wolf on a tree screaming for help. Monkey successfully saved them and began sailing to the nearby island. Thanks a lot for saving everyone, Gorilla. Now we need to throw some ice into the volcano to stop the eruption really quick. Okay sir, let's prevent more damage and save the town. Soon ice is gathered and the fox and gorilla forcefully threw ice into the volcano and the eruption successfully stopped. And the town is back to normal. And the animals are celebrating. I'm really sorry, Gorilla. I'm the one caused this out of jealousy. It's okay, Foxy. You've learned your lesson. Indeed. Here at the zoo land, serene and calm environment with a troublemaker to ruin it all. The fox. And there's the caretaker gorilla. Let's begin the day. Today's task is to bring new zoo animals into this park. <coughs> Mr. Gorilla began marching into the park. And here he approached the fox. Good morning, Gorilla. What brings you here to meet this pathetic fox today? Any help I could offer? New animals are entering our zoo park. So be a good fox. Oh, no, 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 no. Definitely not. I'm trusting you. Clever fox tricked Gorilla with his words again. Now Mr. Gorilla is here with his new animals. He dropped off a tiger in its area. The tiger seems to like his space. You can occupy this pond. He dropped off the crocodile at the pond. And now he drops off the zebra at its land. Finally, the monkey. You can occupy this tree, monkey. <laughs> Perfect. Let me go and rest for a while. <laughs> Perfect. That dumb gorilla and his friends will be troubled by this foxy again. The wicked fox shamelessly began plotting on some trouble again. He easily got out of his space and began to eye upon the tiger. Oh yeah! The fox sneakily shot water upon the tiger. What? The tiger instantly suspects the poor crocodile. And approaches him for a fight. You shameless crocodile! How dare you! What? The crocodile is surprised by the tiger's remarks and fought back while the fox is enjoying the drama. Now it's time to put clashes between the monkey and the crocodile. 
the fox threw a stick on the crocodile. What? And the crocodile surely confused it for the monkey. The monkey is obviously offended and begins fighting with the crocodile. What? <laughs> While the fox is enjoying it from a corner, Now the fox is plotting against the giraffe and monkey. The gorilla caught him stealing the watermelon what? and placing it near the monkey. Oh no! The giraffe and the monkey began quarreling. The actual culprit is behind that tree. He is secretly causing you all trouble. What? All the animals unitedly give an valuable lesson to the wicked fox. Welcome to another hilarious video. Let's go check out what's going on in our jungle today. It looks like our foxy has become rich. Let's see what he's up to. Good day, my cattle. Hey, cows. One by one, I'll draw milk from you and begin our daily routine business. Here you go. Foxy collects milk from all the cows. <laughs> and dumps it into large cans. Oh no! We only have half a can of milk. Let's mix all of this water and fill it up. <laughs> oh yeah! <sighs> Good day, my friends. To make coffee, I need milk. Let's go to Foxy's and get some milk for my coffee. Hey, Foxy, give me one bottle of milk. Sure, Mr. Gorilla. <coughs> What? This is not milk? Foxy cheated on me. I'll go teach him a lesson. Hey Foxy, you gave me water mixed milk and deceived me. Give me pure milk. Hello Mr. Gorilla. Everything I sell is real and healthy. Do not disturb my business by taking too much. You think I'm lying to you? Of course, you should leave. What? Ooh. What? I'll kick you if you cheat anybody in this jungle. Next time, only sell pure milk. Mr. Gorilla had a revelation while sleeping. He told himself that he would only buy cattle and supply pure milk in the forest. He began drawing milk from all of the cows and began selling it on his bike. What? When did he begin supplying milk? I should quit him 
once I feel better. As time passed, Mr. Gorilla's business grew, and he began delivering milk in his large milk truck. What? I should use these nails to stop him from delivering milk. Oh yeah. Let me teach yeah, 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 yeah. him one more lesson. <laughs>